Welcome. Today, we're not just talking about a technology trend. We're examining a fundamental architectural shift that has revolutionized how businesses operate. Software as a Service, or SaaS. What is SaaS? Simply put, it's software delivered over the internet on a subscription basis, eliminating the need for local installation or maintenance. Think back to the old model, the break-fix model. You bought a perpetual license, installed the software from a physical disk or a huge file, and were responsible for the server infrastructure, maintenance, and security patches. It was expensive upfront and rigid. SaaS flipped this on its head. It's a subscription model, pay as you go. The software is hosted in the cloud, giving you instant accessibility from any device, automatic updates, and dramatically lower initial costs. The key value proposition is simplicity. You get the service, not the software. The efficiency of SaaS is rooted in a core architectural concept called multi-tenant architecture. Imagine a large apartment building. Every tenant has their own separate, private space. Their data and configurations are secure and isolated, but they all share the foundational infrastructure the elevators, the plumbing, and the central server platform. This shared infrastructure allows providers to manage and update a massive number of customers simultaneously with minimal effort. This drives down costs for everyone. This architecture enables three crucial benefits. Scalability, need to scale from 10 users to 10,000 overnight. SaaS solutions offer instant scaling up or down with zero effort on your part. Reliability, providers offer service level agreements or SLAs guaranteeing high uptime. They manage the redundancy and disaster recovery, ensuring your critical tools are always available. Automatic updates. You are constantly on the latest and greatest version. Security patches, new features, they appear seamlessly in the background. No more painful, expensive, multi-day migrations. SaaS is everywhere, shaping our work and personal lives in ways we often overlook. In the B2B world, it's foundational. Think CRM like Salesforce, managing sales and customer data seamlessly. Then there's ERP with giants like SAP and Oracle Cloud streamlining procurement and supply chains. Collaboration tools like Slack and Microsoft 365 are essential for remote and hybrid work environments. On the B2C side, SaaS transforms how we consume. Netflix and Disney plus redefine entertainment for us. Music, Spotify and Apple Music have changed the way we enjoy our favorite tunes. And let's not forget storage solutions like Dropbox and Google Drive, keeping our files accessible anywhere. SaaS also splits into horizontal and vertical categories. Horizontal meets broad needs like email and accounting. But the real growth is in vertical SaaS, tailored for specific industries like dental practice management or construction scheduling. This specialization means businesses get solutions that fit them perfectly. Let's dive into some game-changing SaaS examples that have shaped the industry. First up, Salesforce. This pioneer redefined cloud enterprise software for everyone. Then there's Workday, transforming how HR and finance are managed in large organizations. Zoom has become essential, showcasing the importance of a seamless user experience in video conferencing. GitHub is a must-have for DevOps, delivering essential infrastructure entirely as a service. And we can't forget Adobe Creative Cloud, moving expensive desktop software to a flexible subscription model for creators. These examples show that SaaS isn't just a category, it's the go-to method for delivering high-quality continuous service over the cloud. The numbers speak for themselves, painting a clear picture of an industry undergoing a profound acceleration. The global software-as-a-service SaaS market is not merely a segment of the tech world. It is currently estimated to be a massive commercial force and an essential pillar of the modern global economy. The market is valued at approximately $315 billion USD. This figure is often conservative, given the rapid influx of new players and niche solutions. This is not a mature market plateauing into marginal gains. It's one with explosive momentum, signaling vast, untapped potential for innovators and investors alike. Analyst firms consistently project continued aggressive expansion. The market will surpass the half trillion dollar mark well before the end of the decade. We are seeing a high compound annual growth rate of around 18% annually. This sustained rapid expansion is powered by three primary mutually reinforcing dynamics. Businesses across every sector are facing pressure to replace legacy, on-premise systems to remain competitive. SaaS offers speed, scalability, and superior total cost of ownership, making it the default choice for modernizing core business functions. The foundational shift toward global, distributed, and hybrid teams has made SaaS tools the non-negotiable backbone for organizational productivity. These cloud-native solutions facilitate seamless collaboration, communication, and data access 
regardless of geographic location or time zone. The trend of hyper-focusing on niche industry needs is unlocking value in highly specialized sectors. By offering deeply customized workflows and compliance features, these solutions capture enterprise value far more effectively. Let's review a case study on Salesforce, which is not just a successful company, it is the genesis story of modern enterprise SaaS. They famously started with the motto, no software, which was a direct challenge to the incumbents of the late 1990s. Their foundational focus was simple yet revolutionary. Move the complex, clunky, expensive customer relationship management, CRM, software off the customer's premises and into the cloud. This eliminated the need for large upfront capital expenditure, dedicated IT staff, and lengthy installation cycles for their customers. This move pioneered the subscription model where enterprise customers consumed mission-critical functionality as a utility, accessed simply through a web browser. The core promise was agility and continuous updates, a radical departure from the multi-year upgrade cycles of competitors. They demonstrated that the most sensitive corporate data, customer relationships, could be managed securely and efficiently in a multi-tenant cloud environment. Salesforce taught the world that a successful SaaS strategy is about starting focused and then building outward. By focusing intensely on a specialized customer-centric core, CRM, they quickly built market trust and a loyal user base. This trust was leveraged to scale systematically into a multi-cloud enterprise platform, incorporating distinct but integrated offerings like sales cloud, service cloud, and marketing cloud. This organic expansion demonstrated the power of owning the entire customer lifecycle. A key metric and engine of their sustained success is the App Exchange, their revolutionary partner ecosystem. This proved that a strong, open SaaS platform can foster tens of thousands of third-party applications and services, dramatically extending the platform's capabilities without Salesforce having to build every feature itself. This creates a powerful network effect, which not only generates significant partner and subscription revenue, but also locks in customer value by making migration to a different platform incredibly complex and costly. The integrated ecosystem creates a high switching cost for users. Now let us dive into second case study on Zoom the leading video conferencing and collaboration software platform representing the modern era of hyperscale software as a service, SaaS, driven by an exceptional user experience and technological agility. Zoom's rise is a quintessential example of viral product-led growth, PLG. While video conferencing solutions from large incumbents existed, Zoom captured the market because it was demonstrably faster, more reliable, and significantly easier to use. They solved the painful problems of complex installations and unreliable connection quality that plagued previous generations of software. During this sudden global shift to remote work and learning, its inherently low friction adoption model and robust stability made it the immediate necessary default for millions. The free tier was a massive decentralized sales force. The lesson, ease of use, low friction adoption, is everything, forming the bedrock of viral growth. If a product is intuitive enough to require virtually no training, and offers exceptional performance, users will adopt it en masse. This consumer enthusiasm then effectively pulls the tool in into the organization, driving a B2C utility into a must-have enterprise standard, a classic bottom-up sales strategy. Their rapid user acquisition and quick successful transition from a consumer-friendly tool to a highly secure integrated enterprise platform demonstrates the agility and engineering prowess required to succeed in modern SaaS. They didn't just add features, they rapidly scaled the entire platform's capacity, security, and global availability while maintaining quality. This capability to maintain performance under extreme load proves that scalability must be engineered into the core architecture, not simply bolted on later. Future success in SaaS depends less on simple growth and more on becoming an invisible, indispensable part of the business infrastructure. The market is widely projected to surpass $1 trillion in value by the end of the decade. The drivers for this exponential growth are threefold. Hyper-specialized vertical SaaS. More specific solutions for more specific industries. Developing markets adoption. Cloud infrastructure is easier to implement than legacy IT in new markets. AI is shifting the value proposition from automation to intelligence. We are moving toward an everything as a service SaaS economy. A multi-trillion dollar landscape where the idea of installing software is completely obsolete. Services will be delivered by ambient intelligence, anticipating needs and proactively solving problems before users even ask. The most transformative change in SaaS today is the deep integration of artificial intelligence. This is moving the tool from being purely transactional to being truly intelligent. 
Generative AI is the game changer. SaaS products now use models to generate content directly within the application. Automated email drafting in a CRM based on the customer's history. Generating first draft code or documentation in DevOps tools. Creating images and marketing copy in creative suites. AI uses behavioral data to tailor the user interface, workflow, and product recommendations. This makes the application feel uniquely designed for the individual user. This includes AI-driven customer support bots for Tier 1 queries. Predictive maintenance alerts based on usage data are also included. Sophisticated fraud and anomaly detection is part of this operational efficiency. AI is no longer an add-on. It is the embedded intelligence that creates new, superior product categories. To summarize, SaaS is much more than a pricing or subscription model. It is a profound architectural shift that enables unparalleled speed, flexibility, and scalability for businesses of all sizes. The future of this model is defined by three key trends. Winning niche industries with highly tailored solutions is one of them. Integrating payment processing and financial services directly into the SaaS workflow is another. Embedding deep intelligence to automate tasks and create personalized experiences is the third trend. The future of the SaaS market is an exciting era of unprecedented growth, leading to the seamless standardization of essential business tools.